And the Humane Society of Hobart has shared photos and videos from the scene of an incident where at least eight German Shepherd dogs died in an overheated truck while being transported from Chicago O'Hare Airport to their canine training facility in Indiana due to an AC unit that stopped working. Natalie Martinez has the details. The Humane Society of Hobart shares heart-wrenching photos and videos from Thursday night around 740 when they were called to a chaotic scene at the Road Ranger gas stop in Lake Station, Indiana. There was a box truck with 18 shepherds, adult shepherds in, in heat distress. They were seizing on the scene, dying on the scene, um, and had, had heat stroke. There's a call coming in for animal cruelty on Ripley Street. Jenny Weber explains that the Lake Station police, fire, and several Good Samaritans were already at the gas station when they arrived. We noticed that there were many infractions that we noticed, um, one being that they did not have the proper paperwork, no, nor was it presented to us. They also were transporting under conditions that weren't safe to do so. She says they were denied access by police to information, and the driver was able to continue his trip with dead and live dogs on board. The doors off, the animals not secure in the vehicle, and they were able to drive on to Michigan. This was really shocking for us. The chief of police emailed that they won't comment on the investigation until it's completed, but in a Facebook post said that the canines were being transported to a canine training facility from O'Hare Airport to Michigan City, Indiana. The driver got caught in a two-hour traffic delay. The AC unit in the cargo area failed. The post says the driver wasn't aware of the heat-related medical distress until he heard barking. He pulled over, but it was too late for at least eight dogs. Lake Station police call it a freak event, adding in its post that it wasn't an act of animal cruelty or neglect, but a mechanical failure of the AC unit. Tonight, five dogs are hospitalized at two clinics nearby. The Humane Society says they're confused and heartbroken that they weren't able to do more.